Hello there, my little bumblebees. I just want to take a moment to welcome you all to my channel and to my first video. I hope you enjoy me enough that you'll come back for many, many more. And I hope I can keep making content if you really like this video. With that out of the way, let's get to the video's topic. As you can see from the title, I'm going to be discussing why I hate the hashtag bad art. I feel like this hashtag is used badly, if that makes sense. See, I'll go on Instagram and I'll be scrolling through all this wonderfully beautiful art, but it's always on the hashtag bad art. I just don't understand why you would degrade your art and devalue it like that. I've seen some very beautiful and very talented young artists work in this tag before and, well, it makes me very upset to see so many people who feel as if their art deserves to be labeled as something bad. As if just because their drawing skills aren't as developed or nicely rounded like the ones they idolize, they feel it's worthless or ugly undeserving of recognition but I feel like everyone deserves to be noticed you deserve to be the star of your own story draw beautiful artwork without caring about what others may think of it draw what you want and enjoy it don't try to be a people pleaser as you'll gain nothing from that but sadness and suffering trust me I would know as a very long time ago, I felt as if my artwork was never going to be as great and beautiful as the artist I loved. I felt like my art was awful and didn't deserve all the praise I got. But as the years passed, I've started to realize that my art will never be as good as the artist or others' works I admired so much. Because, well... <laughs> I didn't learn the same way that they did. That was the plain and simple fact I failed to realize up until about, I'd say, two years ago. I kept comparing myself to others, thinking I'll never be that good, when all I was really doing by doing that was hurting my self-esteem and ability to love my own art. So my art started to suffer. When I finally kicked myself out of that little loop of comparison, I realized I'll never draw the same or as beautifully as my favorite artist, because a simple fact is, I'm not them. I had to develop my own art style and love every minute, hour, and second put into it, because it would be worth it. After almost 10 years of drawing, I've gotten pretty far and I'm very proud of myself. My art style is still developing, but that's okay, because it's going to take time, and if you're willing to put in the effort, it's worth a try. That's why I feel like everyone needs a little love and encouragement to push them along, and help them grow their style. For me, if it wasn't for all the amazing people I've met who have encouraged me to continue drawing and one day pursue a career in art, then I probably wouldn't be where I am today. I wouldn't be at the skill level. Granted, I'm still learning how to do digital art and am much better and more experienced than traditional. With all that said, please listen to this last part, as I feel it is the most important part of the whole video. When I am scrolling through this hashtag, I can't help but to comment and encourage these wonderful artists on their journey to better their skills. So please, if you ever scroll through the hashtag bad art, please, please, please take the time to stop and admire their work. They put lots of effort and time into making it, so encourage them, examine their artwork, and write a nice comment. Trust me, it'd mean the world to them. Tell them what you love about their piece, and maybe even slip a little bit of advice in to help them improve it. Don't be condescending, though, but maybe say something along the lines of, if they drew a horse, I don't know. Hey, I really love your art style. It's got such a beautiful flow to it, and the way you draw hair is just so gorgeous. But if I may offer a little bit of advice, try referencing horses more. It may help with any anatomy issues or help you learn poses. But anyway, please keep drawing and improve your style. Never stop. Something like that. It'll give them the courage that they need. Trust me, young artists are the ones who need it the most. Anyone doubting their art, 
is in need of some sort of encouragement. Because you need to make sure they know their art can always get better and improve. And so will their style. They'll find their style eventually. And when they do, they'll love every minute and hour, every second, every day, every week, every month, and every moment that they drew and improved their style. They'll love themselves because they never gave up. They tried and they kept trying and kept going with their art style. And who knows, it might be because some stranger encouraged them to. So try to be that stranger. It may help them more than you think. Because it will help them immensely. And it'll just give them the courage and pride for their artwork that they need. So please, next time you see someone use that hashtag, tell them how nice their artwork looks. Because I can guarantee that about 80% of the artwork in that tag doesn't look all that bad and will only get better. I hope you enjoyed my little rant about this topic. And if you want to see more, hit that little subscribe button and hit the bell for notifications on when I upload. I'm going to try to upload every two weeks at least. That is, if school doesn't kill me before I can do that. So please, drop a like, subscribe, hit that little bell for notifications, and please enjoy the rest of the video. All my social media will be tagged below in the description of this video, and will be on the end card title. So thank you for watching, and enjoy!